Happy Vlogmas Day 5! Hello you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. This is Vlogmas in New York, day five. I am just so excited to be getting after it. And it's Monday, big Monday energy. We're doing a lot of gals on the go things today. Brooke and I decided we bought these matching PJs for a video shoot we did last week. And I'm obsessed. They're literally from Amazon. I'll link them down below. They're so comfy. They have other colors. I'm wearing a size medium. Uh, we decided we love how it looks on camera when we record the podcast when we're matching. So uh, she's coming over and we're recording the podcast here in our PJs. I wasn't vlogging last week because I was like prepping for Vlogmas, but last week we moved out of the Gals in the Go studio. Brooke vlogged it, I think, so you can go watch her vlog. But it was bittersweet, but we're really excited to just be more chill and be at our apartments and record. So this week we're recording at my apartment. Next week we're gonna record at her apartment. In today's episode, we're doing a gift guide, um, which I'm really excited about for everyone in your life. We each came up with a ton of things and we're just gonna catch up about our weekends, the whole nine yards. So if you don't already listen to my podcast that I have with Brooke, it's called Gals on the Go, new episodes every Wednesday. It's just like chatting with your two besties. I I think it's a really fun, just something to put on while you're doing laundry or you're driving or you're commuting, whatever it may be. I actually woke up early this morning and got a lot done, which feels really, really good. I've been really into making these priority lists. So I like wake up as I'm drinking my coffee. I'm like, what do I want to get done in what order? And I'm realistic about it. And it's just so nice because then I actually get everything done. So I'm amazed by this revolution I've had for myself. It's nothing crazy, but anyways, Brooke's going to be here in like 30 minutes. I just finished getting ready. I did my makeup. My hair's like really flat today. I washed it last night, so I didn't dice and air wrap it. I just kind of like straightened it this morning. So it's just like very straight, but yeah, you know, it's cute. So yeah, we're recording the podcast, and then after that, I think my manager and Emma, who's our like creative director of Gals on the Go, she's worked with us for years, they're both coming over, and Brooke and I are doing our first run-through of the show, the live show. That's happening this Friday in New York City at Gramercy Theater. If you guys got tickets, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. It's, because it's not like a live podcast. Like, we have segments, we have things planned. It's not scripted necessarily, but we have segments, so we want to like run through it, make sure each segment is timed right, and everything and we're gonna have Emma like doing slides for us we need to make sure timing with that there's just a lot going on so we're gonna do that run through here and then we'll be done with all the gals and the go things for the day I have a Whole Foods grocery delivery later which I'm really excited about all of my meals that I planned in yesterday's vlog um, I'm getting all those groceries so we'll do a grocery haul um, Ryan's finally back um, in New York and I'm really excited I, I really missed him so I think we're gonna hang out tonight that's kind of the lay of the land. I hope you're all having a fabulous day. Let's get started with this vlog. I feel so bad. So my apartment is currently 66 degrees and my heat's not working. I, Whenever I turn it on, it just blows cold air and I know I'm doing it right. So it's gonna be another, you know, talk to the super situation that I've been putting off, which I know is so bad. You guys are so mad at me right now. Um, but I told Brooke, I was like, just by the way, cause Brooke runs really cold, especially recently. Like she's just been like extra cold. So I texted her, I was like, hey, just FYI, like my heat's not working. If you want to bring a jacket, she's like, oh my God, thank you so much for letting me know. I've been running cold. Do you want me to bring my space heater? <laughs> and I was like, I'm good. Like I'm honestly comfortable, but like it's cozy for me. But if you want to bring your space heater, please do. 
because I know we're gonna be here for a while. I feel bad, so we'll see. I don't know how big it is. I've never had a space heater, so I don't know. I could see a world in which she brings it, which that'll make me happy because then she'll be warm and cozy, so. Yeah, I'm just cultivating the vibes. I really hope it doesn't smell like bacon in here right now. I made bacon this morning, turkey bacon, and I was a little nervous that it might like smell weird. Like I don't smell it, but I'm like wondering if I walk out of my apartment, I walk back in if it's gonna smell. I hope not. I have like so many candles going just to like erase the scent. Okay, I'm playing around with the lighting right now. Last week when we kind of did the mock setup, we had our videographer's soft boxes and it definitely helped brighten it up a lot more in here. So, and I've just got my ring light. So we're just, you know, just like when we moved into the office and we were doing trial and error with that, it's gonna be the same thing here. Once Brooke gets here, one of us will be able to like sit and play with the lighting. It's just harder for me to do alone. But yeah, she's on her way. I'm excited. Hey guys, we just finished recording. It was a great episode, it was a long episode. So if you like having a long episode, that was one. And we gave some great gift guide ideas, so that'll be fun. I have leftovers, nothing like having leftovers from dinner for lunch. Um, Brooke's here, she's, Hi. she's working. Oh, um, vlog Miss <laughs> Hey, I feel like Remy right now, cooking with Remy. Me heating up my pasta. Like. No, I love it. So I'm just heating up a little lunch, and then Emma and Karen will be here soon. And I'm kind of like nervous to do this run through. Me too, me too. I feel like it's gonna be like I always get nervous. Like it, it's giving um like dress rehearsal from, but obviously not actually. It dress is giving rehearsal, dress rehearsal. Yeah, you know, like you would do dress rehearsal. Yeah, when you would do it like, like mic check, play, you'd be like ooh, it's the real deal. Yeah, it's like you can't just be like, and then we'll do that. Yeah, like, you actually have to do it. Like exactly. that's what we've been saying on our calls. Like, and then we'll say this, and but we actually are gonna have to like take ourselves seriously and like do it. Yeah, as like Emma and Karen are watching us. There's a lot of elements to the show though that are like live so there's some I mean obviously we yeah do, true there's a lot of like things that it's like this could go one way or another way you know I know like, you guys better not give us any surprises no. it'll be good in that way but that's the that's the beauty of live theater baby you never get the same show twice <laughs> showbiz baby that's just showbiz baby <laughs> but there's one segment that we're like keeping a surprise from each other so we're gonna like go in the other room and like do it for them without us just to make sure like you know, we want someone to see it before we surprise everybody, 400 people on stage. So yeah, that's what's going on here. It was really nice recording in our home. It just feels so right. We have things here and we're able to just like upload the podcast now. Like it's just so nice. So that's that on that. I really don't know what else to say. These days are always tough for vlogs because we were doing a lot of things. Oh yeah. There are things you guys can't see. We were writing the cue cards. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Brooks vlogging for TikTok. <laughs> Look at these cue cards. Emma made these. They're the cutest things in the world when we were writing on literally. them. Literally. We feel really, really good about the show now. We like literally did the show. Like I'm tired. I know, I know. <laughs> like I'm tired. Well, we also right recorded now. before too, so we is wow. Yeah, we had a day of talking. I need oh, to that makes me feel better. Coat tea and yes. get cozy. Cozy. I did forget we early did record the podcast. Yes. Early and Danielle, in. I really come to my final decision. I'm sorry to roast on, especially on your vlog. Your apartment is fucking freezing. I'm sorry. It really <laughs> yeah, why is. Why is it so cold? Thank you. The Thank heat's you. not working. The heat's not Guys, working. Guys, tell her. Like, it's 69 in here right no, now. No, that's incorrect. For Danielle, that's incorrect. Are you freezing too? Oh, God. I know it's cold because you touch the bathroom counter and it's like cold to the touch. No, like, you sit yeah. on the couch and the couch. Yes, you're right. Oh my God. Like, I'm so it's sorry. Cold. All right, I'll call my super. I get nervous. I, it's I have a fear of like asking I know, I know. him I for things. Really I mean, yeah. so no, it's something's cold. wrong. I Everyone just left. I immediately took off all my makeup and we did. Like I said, we did the full run through of the show. We're feeling really good about it like and it's kind of nice that we did this today on monday because now 
we can just kind of like relax the rest of the week. It's done, you know, like review it every now and then, but it's not like we have to have anything memorized. So I'm really happy about that. I was like, why am I so tired though? Like I was really drained and Brooke reminded me, we also recorded an hour and a half podcast before we did the show run through, which we won't be doing the day of the show. So I think that, that it made more sense. So I was like, that's why I'm so drained. So I'm kind of in that, like, what should I do now? And I feel like a lot of people deal with this. It's like, okay, it's like, you know, I could either like get cozy for the night or I could go to the gym, you know? I'm doing a Pilates class tomorrow and I have training with my trainer on Wednesday, but I like weirdly kind of want to work out or just, I haven't left the house today. I think that's what it really is. And I'm really blessed that I've been able to do all of my, everyone's come to me today. <laughs> um, and Ryan's coming over later. We're going to make dinner together. I'm still waiting. My Whole Foods delivery guy is almost here. So I'm just waiting to see that and I'm just kind of hungry right now, but I don't want to make full dinner. You know, just like all those things. It's like, what's my next move? Ideal plan is get all my groceries, put them all away, have a little snack now, go to the gym. Honestly, even just do like 12, 3, 30, listen to a podcast, get in the steam room and then come back and make dinner with Ryan. Whole Foods delivery is here, a little haul. Got more turkey. I love eating turkey with these cauliflower sandwich thins. They're so good. Flour tortillas because one of the meals I'm making, if you guys didn't watch yesterday's um, video, I did meal planning for the week. I'm doing ground turkey tacos one day. My favorite hummus is Ithaca hummus and I haven't found a place near my new apartment that sells Ithaca hummus. Whole Foods does, but they don't have just the original one, which is really weird. But I realize I like Ithaca hummus because there's like citrus in it. So I'm trying this Cedars lemon hummus. I hope it's good. Like I haven't found anything better than Ithaca. They didn't have any fresh broccoli. So I got frozen broccoli, chicken, green beans for sides for meals this week. Cause I was gonna do chicken, couscous, and green beans, ground turkey for the tacos, assortments of berries for just, for enjoying. I didn't get more yogurt, so they will be for just eating. Four of my favorite kombucha. And then over here I got more avocados, a couple bananas. I got some yellow rice, cause I wanna make yellow rice and black beans with green beans for a meal. It's one of my favorite meals, okay? I'm weird. Couscous, this stuff is so good. I've made this exact one before and it was literally, I could not stop eating it. It's so tasty. These, my mom had these when I was home for Thanksgiving, are so tasty dipped into hummus. It just like kind of tastes like the hummus, but they're like, you know, pretty good. They're organic. They're like CD crackers. So I feel like they're good for me. Then I got brown sugar because I want to start eating oatmeal again and I haven't found a way to eat oatmeal without brown sugar. So that is my little Whole Foods haul. I'm going to put all this away now and decide my next move. Is she going to the gym? Is she not? She wants to go to the gym. So let's see. <laughs> Verdict is in. We're going to the gym. I missed, I was gonna sign up for this Pilates fusion class and there are, there's wait list and it's fine because I'm literally going to Pilates class tomorrow. So we're just gonna go do some 12, 3.30. I have this workout set on from Story. I'm a Georgia Bulldogs sweatshirt, of course. These sneakers are APL and then my socks are Amazon. And I'm just gonna throw on my big black puffer jacket from the brand Sam. And yeah, I'm gonna listen to a podcast or music. We'll see how I go. 30 minutes and then hopefully get in the steam room a little bit too. Maybe that'll help my sinuses. Even though I'm not sick, but my head has been hurting. Um, people are telling, telling me it's sinus pressure, which I fully believe. So let's go do it. I'm not like putting a ton of pressure on myself. The other day I went and I did I did 8 3.30 instead of 12 3.30, you know, or maybe I'll do 8 2.5.30. So I'll get, I'll do an incline of 8 rather than 12, um, speed 3, sometimes 2.5 I do, you know, gonna be real. And then I always try at least do for 30 minutes, whatever it is. Um, even just walking, because I just like haven't really walked today, and it's so cold out, so I'm not really gonna go for a walk, and it's dark outside now, so I'm feeling good. Like I should. Hey, let's leave the house. I haven't left the house yet. I'm 
back from my workout now and I don't feel like amazing. Like I feel, I took it easy on myself. I also just, sometimes when I have really amped up days, like lots of talking, lots of like overexerting myself with like podcasting, stuff like that. When I work out at night, I just, there's like a lot more on my mind and I kind of get more overwhelmed. So when I do cardio and I'm also overwhelmed, I'm like, huh? So I think I would have benefited more from like going to that Pilates class, but it was full and like doing more of like a strength training or like a Pilates, more of like a class rather than like me alone with my thoughts on a treadmill. I don't know. I used to always prefer night workouts, but now I feel like I kind of prefer earlier in the day. Crazy, adulting, we changed our minds. I'm gonna shower. I did the steam room too. It was really, really lovely. I probably sat in there for like 10 minutes and it was really gross. I didn't shower there because I just wanna like come home and like use my products and shower and have to shave and all that. So I was like, I would just rather do that here. So I like put my clothes back on, but they weren't that sweaty. I did, I didn't even do 30 minutes. I did 25 minutes and I did like a speed of 2.7 and incline of six to eight. Like I kept switching. So, you know, I'm happy I like got out of the house and did it and I definitely feel more relaxed now So I guess that's a plus but in the moment there was just so many people there. I forget that like it's prime time I got the last treadmill, so we're gonna shower and then Get the vibes right and Ryan's gonna be here. I'm so excited to see him and we're gonna make dinner Just showered put on comfy clothes. Wow, I look really cute. Um, the Bucks game is on tonight So that'll be fun. Oh, there's Tampa. I miss Tampa. I literally was just there, but I feel like I didn't do anything when I was in Tampa. Next time I'm going to Tampa, I'm doing all the things. Okay, the results are in. For dinner tonight, we're doing couscous because this stuff is literally crack. Like, it's so good. I'm My mouth is salivating just thinking about it. We're gonna do chicken, couscous, and I literally just had green beans yesterday and today for lunch, but I kind of want to do them again. Here we go. <laughs> Ryan, Merry Christmas. It's Ryan Paws. <laughs> Dinner is just about done. We're gonna eat. Oh, now this looks good. It's great, thank you. You're welcome. Delicioso. He's working. Stop working. All right, guys, I have a bit of a sweet tooth right now, so we're gonna make some cookies. Very excited, I really just want the cookie dough. So I'm definitely gonna have one, but we're gonna make some cookies. Okay, let's see. Preheat the oven to 350. Ugh. Oh wait, <laughs> hold on, let me take this out. This like won't go anywhere else because it's like a weird shape. It's for my pizza, so I store it in my oven. But I have to remember when I actually preheat the oven okay yay also shout out kenzie i got her breadwinning housewife um dish towel i love it i am so excited <sighs> oh my gosh ryan do you like cookie dough yeah? yeah do you like get excited about it like i get excited about this oh my god I forgot I have milk from that time I randomly wanted cereal. So I'm gonna pour us some little milk shots with our cookies. Yum, I'm so excited. I don't get a sweet tooth a lot, but when I do, it's very exciting. Look, got his little milk shots. Oh, you don't even fit in the frame. <laughs> Shit, okay. Cheers. Cheers. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's a good warm cookie. Mm, good. Oh, the taste of real milk, unmatched. <laughs> like, why, like, did you, as a kid, did you, like, drink milk? 
Like I would like drink a glass of milk. He's a little kid, maybe. But then I had to stop because it was making me break out. The happy dance. <laughs> <laughs> wiggle, wiggle. Mm. Really good. Ryan's still working. I made him come take a break. <laughs> he got hit with some surprise work while he was here. Yep. Part of the job. Oh my gosh, the Bucks just had an amazing win. We love to see that. We also watched an episode of Fleischman is in Trouble. Um, it's on Hulu. It's a show I'm watching right now. It's really good. Um, this week's episode was kind of like all over the place. It was crazy. Santa's leaving. Do you have anything to say? Merry, uh, night night. <laughs> I don't know. What does it say at the end of the night? Merry oh, Christmas yeah. to you all and to all a good night. Probably Anyways. Little, it's probably a little early for the, <laughs> that, but. That's the end of Vlogmas Day 5. I hope you guys enjoy it and I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Night.